Table 12 is brought to you by Favor. No app delivers more for Texas. Hi, I'm Lauren Bebo. On this week's episode of Table 12, we're at High Tides in Bridge City, where you can get a taste of coastal cuisine and so much more. Let's grab a seat along the water and see what they're serving up. Joining us at the table today is Vaden, the manager of High Tides Restaurant and Marina in Bridge City. Smells like seafood. Vaden, tell us, what, what are we looking at today? So here we have our chargo oysters, which we have jalapeno bacon and the garlic parmesan. Those look fantastic and bigger than most oysters I'm used to seeing. And I have uh, the royal red shrimp over here. Those are some of my favorites. You don't see a lot of places serving royal reds, so when I come out here, I've got to have them. Uh, here we have a barbecue bacon burger and then uh, the Cal Bayou Classic, which is just a roast beef po' boy, um, served with the lettuce, cheese, and then a side of chips. That po' boy is gigantic and looks delicious. And then we have these beautiful Bloody Marys. Yours has bacon, mine doesn't. I know you can customize them. Yes, uh, you can add lime, olive, okra, bacon, uh, cocktail shrimp, an oyster if you wanted to, green beans, pickles, whatever. But I think what makes us different than any other restaurant around here is uh, we have the ability to where you can pull your boat up off the water, uh, dock up here, dine in, take out, pet friendly. We have live music every weekend. Now, Vaden, tell us about this really big boat behind us. What's that about? So it's a 87 foot yacht. It's a houseboat. You can rent it out for like Airbnb. Uh, you can do a day travel with it, stuff like that. Uh, and if you do rent it out, like for an overnight stay, you can take you to the Nugget, to Galveston. Wow. Yeah, it has a lot of cool little features on that it. That is so fun. What a great amenity. And did you mention that food and drinks are included in the price with the Airbnb? Exactly. Time? So uh, okay. if you do decide to you know, charter the boat out, mm -hmm. there'll be a captain, a deckhand. Uh, you can have a bartender if you wish. Okay. And it's fully food catered and uh, drinks and alcohol and whatever you prefer. Sounds like a great time. So when I describe this place to people, I say it's kind of like a beach cabin, but it's in Bridge City and it's along the water. Mostly some people, they'll come out here off the boat, you know, mm -hmm. hanging out at the sandbar, they'll come in here, have a drink. Yeah. Just cause it's outside and the sunset and like pretty nice, you know, whenever yes. people will be out here taking pictures and stuff like that. Yes. Um, cause okay. we also have an inside and a party room that's sectioned off as well. Nice. Yes, you do have an indoor air-conditioned bar for people who might not want to sit outside. This is such a fun atmosphere and something you don't often find in Southeast Texas. Yeah, it's definitely different. It's not just the food that's great here. Tell us a little bit about the staff. I know it's a locally owned spot and that, you know, means something to the community. So most of the staff that we have here, they've been here either since the very beginning or shortly after we opened. We try to accommodate to everybody differently. Like, if I know that you like this meal, I will try to have it out for you, you know, already. If you order the same thing, it's like, wow. uh, we just kind of build a good customer reputation. Lots of regulars. Yeah. Lots of regulars, yeah. Saw a regular here when I came, and I know when I'm in Bridge City, sometimes I'll come here for lunch, I'll sit on the t uh, the top floor and just look at the view, and it's, it's such a nice getaway. So what's it like serving the Southeast Texas community? Uh, being originally from Bridge City, graduating and going to school here, uh, I kind of take a lot of pride in it because I feel like it's a self-reflection of me, you know, and the customer service that people get here and the quality of food and the experience that they uh, experience being here. Yeah. So I, I like it. I enjoy it. Oh, yeah. I definitely get a community feel when I come here and the food is delicious. So are the drinks. It's just an added bonus. So if people want to know more about High Tides, where can they find you? So we have a website page, an Instagram page, and a Facebook page. And the Facebook page is constantly updated with which bands we're having, which day, uh, specials that we'll put out, hours if they do change, and updated menu and stuff like that. Well, if you want delicious red shrimp and oysters and gigantic po' boys without driving to Lake Charles, stop by High Tides in Bridge City. See you next time on Table 12. Brought to you by Favor. No app delivers more for Texas.